Chapter One. The audition. It's your big day tomorrow, Sophia. Says Laura to her younger sister. I know. I can't wait. My audition for Sing to Win. Says Sophia. You're an amazing singer. Says Laura. The judges are going to love you. Then you can be on TV. In front of millions of people. Sophia laughs. <laughs> Thanks, Laura. You only say that because you're my big sister. The next day, Sophia is waiting for her audition. In front of her, there is a girl with pink hair. Hey, Sophia says, "I love your hair." Thanks, I like yours too," says the girl. Just then, a reporter arrives. How are you feeling, girls? Excited, they say together. Then they laugh. Are you sisters? The reporter asks. Uh, no. Says Sophia. Friends. Well, yes, we are now. Says the girl. I'm Emma. She says to Sophia. Soon, it is Emma's audition. Here's my number. Says Sophia. Text me after your audition. Okay. Emma says. And, good luck. Thanks, you too. Emma smiles. Now, it is Sophia's audition. The judges are watching her, and everyone is very quiet. Suddenly. She feels nervous. This is it. She thinks. She sings well. And two of the judges say yes. But she needs yes from all three judges. Or she cannot be in sing to win. Sophia waits nervously. After a long minute, the third judge says, "Okay, yes." Wow! Says Sophia happily, and claps her hands. Chapter Two: Friends. That night, Sophia. Gets a text from Emma. Are you going to be in Sing to Win? Emma 
kiss. Yes. You. Wow. Me too. Amazing. Want to meet on Saturday? One p.m. Do you know the Happy Cafe? Yes. See you there. It is Saturday at the cafe. Sophia and Emma are talking about Sing to Win. Our auditions are online now, and people love us. Emma says. I know. It's amazing. Sophia says. You have twenty-three thousand four hundred and twenty-nine likes. Yes, and you have twenty-one thousand six hundred and thirty-two. Oh. And look at this. People want us to sing together. I like that idea. What do you think? Asks Sophia. Emma is quiet, and she looks away. I don't know, Sophia. I'd like to sing on my own. I get very nervous when I sing with people. That's okay. It's only an idea. I'm sorry, says Emma. It doesn't matter. Hey, are you going to have a sandwich? Asks Sophia. Yes. Good idea. Says Emma. And they look at the menu. Just then. Sophia and Emma hear a new song in the cafe. They look up. Oh, I love this song," says Emma. "I love it too." <laughs> Sophia laughs. Chapter Three. Selfish Emma. There is one month before the first round of Sing to Win. Sophia and Emma are doing things every day. They learn new songs. And speak to reporters, but they text a lot and meet at the weekends. Lots of people like them. They want to see Sophia 
and Emma in the final. One afternoon, Sophia is talking to some reporters. Why is your hair blue? asks one reporter. Which singers do you like? asks a second. Then the reporter from the audition says, Are you going to sing with Emma in the first round? No, I'm going to sing on my own. But people want you to sing together, says the reporter. Well, Emma doesn't want to, says Sophia. But I'm okay with that. The next morning, Sophia texts Emma. Hi. How are you? She texts her again after breakfast. Me again. Are we meeting today? Emma does not answer. So Sophia texts her again. In the afternoon, you're quiet today. Nervous. Then Emma answers. Don't text me again. Just then, Sophia's sister arrives home. Are you okay? asks Laura. No, says Sophia. And she tells her sister about the texts. It's because of the story. Laura says. What story? Sophia asks about you and Emma. Look, selfish Emma wants to sing on her own. Says Sophia. Sophia wants to sing with Emma. But Emma says, "No, I'm better than Sophia." Oh no! Says Sophia. It isn't true. Why? Perhaps the reporter wants a good story. Says Laura. Sophia phones Emma, but Emma does not answer. Soon, everyone is talking about the story. People do not like Emma now. Sophia. Is right. Emma is selfish. Hashtag selfish Emma. Emma wants to win on her own. Bad idea. Sophia is a better singer than Emma. Hashtag. Sophia better. 
Sophia is going to win. With or without Emma. Sophia speaks to the reporter. That story isn't true, she says. Emma isn't selfish. But now, lots of people are talking about you and Emma, he says. Selfish Emma is the biggest story of Sing to Win. And it's good for you. But it's wrong, Sophia says. It doesn't matter, the reporter says. Chapter Four, the first round. It is the first round of Sing to Win. But Sophia is not very excited. I'm going to see Emma today, at Sing to Win. She says to Laura. She isn't speaking to me, and I feel bad about the story. Listen, Sophia, forget it. The reporter is wrong, not you," says Laura. "I know, but." Says Sophia. No buts. You need to be excited again. Do you love singing? Asks Laura. Well, yes. Then sing, sing to win. Now Sophia is on the stage. She wants to sing well, but she is very nervous. Millions of people are watching her. The judges watch and listen carefully. She is good. The judges like her, and the audience like her too. Sophia, Sophia, Sophia! They shout. Now Sophia feels better, but next. It is Emma. The audience do not like Emma. Boo! They shout. Emma waits. She looks at her feet, and her face is red. Sophia. Feels sorry for her. Oh no! She thinks. Shh. Say the judges. Be quiet, everyone. Then Emma sings. Her voice is beautiful. She is amazing. The audience are quiet now. Very quiet.
When Emma finishes, they all clap and stand up. The judges are standing up too. Emma smiles. Then all the singers are on the stage together. What are the judges going to say? Everyone is waiting for them. The singers all want to be in the second round, but one person must go home. The audience clap. And shout. Then, the judges stand up and say, "Goodbye, Harry." Sophia and Emma are in the second round. Sophia finds Emma. When they come off the stage, oh Emma, you're an amazing singer. Thanks, says Emma quietly. Emma, I'm sorry. The story isn't true. You're not selfish. Can we forget about it? Sophia asks. This time, Emma does not answer. She looks down. Sophia runs away. She is crying. And she does not want Emma to see. The next day, all the stories are about Emma. Sophia and Laura read them together. Amazing, Emma! Everyone loves Emma. Emma can sing to win. I'm sorry, Sophia. Nobody is talking about you now," says Laura. "It's okay. I'm happy for Emma, and I'm in the second round too." But I want to be friends again," she says. "Give it some time," says Laura. Then talk to her again. Chapter Five, the final. Two days later, Sophia gets a text from Emma. Can we meet at the Happy Cafe tomorrow at eleven thirty? Emma, kiss. The next day, Sophia arrives at the Happy Cafe. At eleven thirty, Emma is sitting at a table near the window. Um, hi, says Sophia. Hi, says Emma. Listen, Sophia. The story isn't true. I can see that now. 
Reporters want a new story every day. I'm sorry. Oh, thank you, Emma. I need to listen to my friends, not reporters. They only want a good story. You're right, says Sophia. There are seven more rounds of Sing to Win. Every week, one singer goes home. And every week, Sophia thinks, Is it me? But she is good. And the audience and the judges like her. They love Emma too. They are both in the final. And better than that, they are friends again. It is the big final. Sophia and Emma sing song after song after song. Sometimes Sophia is better. And sometimes Emma is better. But they are both amazing. Millions of people are watching them. In the audience and on TV. They stand on the stage together. Who is the winner? Sophia feels very nervous. They wait for the judges. But the judges talk and talk. Some people are shouting, Sophia! Some are shouting, Emma! There is a lot of noise. Suddenly, the judges call the winner's name. Emma! Sophia smiles. She is second, but she is happy for her friend. A judge says to Emma and Sophia, Are you going to sing together now? Yes, yes, sing together! The audience shout. Emma looks at Sophia. Let's do it, she says. Really? says Sophia. Yes, says Emma. She takes Sophia's hand and they sing. Friends together. Music